Update 1.5 is finally coming to NASB 2. And Mr. Krabs has just been revealed for today as well for patch 2.15. We're going to look at Mr. Krabs first, and then we're going to go look at patch 1.5. So Mr. Krabs drops on patch 2.15, so it means probably next patch after this patch, which patch 1.5 comes out today, by the way. If you didn't know, on 2-9-2024, it is coming out today, finally, with a bunch of fixes and everything else in between. But also, Mr. Krabs is going to be coming soon. Next patch, I think, after this one. Let's look. Oh, baby. I'm an average crab, baby. That's cool. Ooh. Everybody's gonna play the crap out of him. Oh, his little violin. Now smash. He's a sword? He's forward air. And he has, he has a dolphin noise. Oh my God. Love this. Oh my god. Minecraft Steve type throw. Oh, his ultimate? That's awesome. Wait, coming out on February 15th. So yeah, patch 2.15 then. That means it's going to come out in like a few days as well. Oh my god. I was nervous that they weren't going to be able to do things in time, that they were taking too long. Hopefully now that we have seen what the patch is going to look like and see what crabs it looks going to look like, that we can finally move forward with our time. I'm excited to see what they do. But now we're going to go through this patch update 1.5 controller updates general fixes and recoveries now let's get through this together y'all patch 1.5 general fixed projectiles getting destroyed when hitting the vertical sides of thin platforms that was annoying glad they fixed that can no longer slime cancel landing lag from fall helpless state okay fixed dash tag getting buffered out of tech situations to the light attacks that that, that was annoying me fix for grab pummel giving slime points to incorrect character what the hell <laughs> Fixes to quick play ranked matchmaking. Thank God. Characters can now wall jump with their back towards the wall. Oh, thank you. Yes. I was wondering why I couldn't do that. Rebound state no longer makes a character leave the edge. Fixed issue in which a character would enter an aerial state after tech in place, causing roll distance issues. Fixed an issue where movement buffs affected the way characters during ledge getups. Okay. They, they mess up that part on, on the wording, whatever reason. Fixed an issue where game controllers started using the Xbox layout, making certain buttons swap to each other. Okay. That sucks. But at least, at least it's fixed. Fixed an instability issue with game controllers where they would get disconnected and added as extra controllers internally causing several issues stages adjusted the height of shark and palm platforms in aquarium and food dreams alternate layouts added thank god that's gonna be cool oh now they're going straight they didn't even do a thing for characters they're just going straight into characters all right jimmy fix an issue where jimmy would hit himself with a tommy ball when throwing it out upwards or forwards recovery adjustments on jimmy is special up edge grab size reduction can be canceled with air dodge and reduce floatiness and recovery. Ooh, Jimmy's about to be good. Change air down. Air can only stall once per air time. Bounce, reset, stall. Okay, nice. Interesting. All right, that is good changes for Jimmy. But he kind of has a slight nerf. Gerald, fix an issue where Gerald would not recover his up special after grabbing the edge. That is bad. Well, at least it fixed, they fixed it for Gerald. And then the recovery adjustments for Gerald are charge air up can only stall once per air time. Special forward can only be used once per air time. Now we're at Garfield. Yo, they finally did it. Fixed an issue where sugar rush mode was never deactivated. Garfield is now unable to perform down special or slime down special while in sugar rush mode. Hopefully it doesn't create a new glitch for him. Recovery adjustments up special reduced height for all versions and the special neutrals can only stall once per air time. I'm nervous about April. Fix an issue where April's aerial back jump would play the forwards air jump animation while using the air jump back hurt boxes. That is weird. Oh yeah, I think I felt that before. Fix an issue where camera flashes were applying a little bit hit stun. What is up with these patch notes? Whoever went over this didn't like double check what they were saying. It's a little bit weird and wonky on the uh, English. Recovery adjustments. Special down cannot be recovered on hurt while in air. Oh, no, you can't. So if I use it once, I don't get to use it again. Oh, my God. And special up grab size reduction. That sucks. Oh, no. <laughs> They're nerfing April. That's funny. Squidward. Fix a visual bug on charge air down line that makes... Squidward jumps slightly higher out of the state. This movement bus no longer affect the way characters can behave during ledge get-ups. Squidward can no longer overshoot the edge when in rage mode. Okay, cool. Special up startup increase on his recovery adjustment. And the special down can only be done once per air time. And the charge air up only one per air time. Damn, they really are going hard on everybody. They're like making everybody kind of more honest in a way. Danny. Recovery adjustment, special up range increased. Special forward air time uses refresh.
push on hurt without availability frames and then charge air up can only start once per air time charge air down can only stall once okay yeah because everybody would just stall and then just get back for free ang recovery adjustments special up edge grab size reduction and dive follow-up rate damage reduced special neutral air drift reduced while charging and the charge air down can only start once per air time i don't know did they even do the recora recora recovery adjustments fixed transition after a special forward without an air special up edge grab size reduction and the charge air down can only saw once per air time so they're doing this for everybody Raphael recovery adjustment special down can only be used once per air time special up reduction again Donatello looks like charge air down can only start once per air time I'm going to Reptar get up in place recovery frames increase to 30 to match other characters oh no wonder I couldn't tech chase that stupid character recovery adjustment special up increase startup before the start of the fall and the special forward can only stall once per air time with a charge air down reducing the stall time charge air up reduce stall time we're getting towards the bottom now mecha plankton fix a bug where recovery frames increase with each subsequent press of the attack on hit of light down and follow-ups plankton can act out of get up in place on frame 30 to match other characters and fix poses of characters by hit by ultimate they're fixing a lot of stuff and then the recovery adjustments for plankton is all air options that require the rocket boost to hover now share the same fuel supply reset off land or of land i don't understand i nerf i'm assuming oh ember recovery adjustments charge air down only start one time charge air up only start once oh my god here we go special up size grab increased oh they gave her better like they gave her more magnet hands on recovery on the ledge nice not bad for ember denny light up ponytails are now also intangible oh they're giving her some love but also the recovery adjustments making it so special forward can only stall once charge her down can only stall once same thing with charge up only once for stall now we're going to ren and simpy looks like they didn't get as much charge air down can only stall once per air time it's not like they were using that a bunch so it's not going to change that much for them just more consistency across the board invader zim fixed a bug that prevented him from landing on some stages after using an edge attack okay recovery adjustments charge air down reduce air drift on hold and special up increase horizontal Okay, they needed to help him with his special, so it's definitely good for that. El Tigre. Recovery adjustments for him. Adjusted the window, he can grab the ledge during special up special up and charge up stall. And the air does not come back on hit. Okay, so if I get hit out of it, you don't get to do it again. They're doing that for everyone. Fix a bug on Daggett that prevented the assist to be called the, the slime version. Special adjustments, special up size reduced on upper hitbox, reduced vertical movement on slime version, and the hurt box is adjusted. Okay, and Norbert getting one too. Fix the bug that prevented hit the assist as well for him with the slime version, and recovery adjustments, special up increase in height. Okay, so Norbert's up special is going to be better now. He's going to be able to recover a little bit better. Nigel, what are they going to do for him? Special up increased height on slime version. Charge air down can only stall once per air time. Charge air up only stalling once. Okay. And pretty much everybody has that. Everyone has this, which is crazy, but some of them don't, which is kind of weird. I don't know what is up with that. One Bob recovery adjustments. Special neutral can only stall once per air time. And the special up increased recovery and adjusted the window where he can grab the edge. I hope that it, this doesn't like super mess things up that they're doing this to every character. It's going to be taking some use to. So this patch that dropped today is going to have to get used to that ASAP. Patrick. Recovery adjustment, special up increase startup, charge air up, only stall once per air time as the other ones. And Azula, oh man, we're coming to the end right now. Azula adjusted special forward late hitbox and position and size for both aerial and grounded versions with the recovery adjustment, reduced speed and height of the special slime up, which is her up special that is going to be reduced speed and height, which is crazy that they're nerfing her again. <laughs> she is annoying, I will say. Grandma Gertie, adjustments to special down items and projectile sound effects, and they changed the tether behavior. So the tether behavior has improvements. They didn't make it so she couldn't stall, but she only can stall one time anyway so she's already fine so that's why she doesn't have that on hers recovery adjustments and then Rocco is the last character they're showcasing for this patch Rocco recovery adjustments special forward can only be done once per air time with a special up hitbox rework oh increase speed when going up with added with a delay with no hitbox before starting to fall downwards and adjusted the window where he can grab the head oh my god okay Rocco that kind of is a weird one so anybody who plays Rocco let me know how you feel about Rocco's changes and everybody's changes if you guys play any of these characters let me know how you guys feel about them with Mr. Krabs coming out in the next patch on the 15th expect a video for that when he does drop because they're probably going to be showcasing everything he can do and it's going to be really cool to see what he can do and I'm excited to say I'm going to probably main him or play him at least and I really feel like he's going to be a hilarious Hilarious. If you guys saw the video in the very beginning, he definitely is going to be hilarious. But if you guys like what you're on the scene, make sure you like and subscribe and hit the bell button so you can see everything I do every gosh darn week. Soldier, we're going to be coming back with some more videos in the future, especially with this new patch 1.5 dropping and the Mr. Krabs patch coming soon after. Let me know down below in the comments, and I'll see you next time, Soldier. Goodbye. Ooh, we ride.